All right, here we go. Oof. Okay, let me refamiliarize myself with this. So if we, we get bonuses if we stack classes, and we get bonuses if we stack factions. Multiple Azera together will do things. Multiple Thieves together will do things. You can see the synergy. Multiple Azeras. If we have two Azeras together, we get more attack and defense. And to people who are nearby, that I think nearby means like one, like adjacent to. So when you're really spread out, this is good for clustering. So in, in comps where you want to cluster together, Azera is good. This one is great. The uh, the Rangar. Rangar gets you additional powder, which means you can level your stuff up even faster. It makes it easier to build. Dragon Knights were pretty strong. It was tough to build, beat a team of Dragon Knights. Freaking six turns of skill nullifiers. If you can get all four Spirit Lords on the team, you have a damn near unstoppable team. Theron had is kind of useless. Palisha lets you be higher level than you actually are, so that's huge. Free stats. Uh, city Lords are insane. You get additional people on your team with City Lords. Warriors is just raw more damage. That's kind of a niche one. Knights. Um, two and four Knights aren't that big of a deal, but six Knights getting the Reflect is freaking amazing. Rangers. Um, Putting target, which is additional damage for five seconds during the fight, is really nice. Five rangers is a thing. Um, three mages. Grants a barrier. Pro yeah, the giant ass barrier for 20 seconds, which is really great on mages who are otherwise, otherwise squishy. Getting this fat barrier for 20 seconds. But 20 seconds, the fight's damn near over. It's huge. Mage teams are hard to, hard to beat. Uh, thieves. Th if you have four thieves, you grant stealth for 20 seconds, which is really great for sneaking your units behind enemy lines and killing their archers and range attacks because the frontliners will ignore them as the thieves run by. Just need to make sure you place your thieves in a way that they run past the front line to the back line and don't engage with the front line units and reveal themselves. And soul weavers are a great way to get immunity for 20 seconds, which can be nice in certain situations. So now that you know the synergy, and you notice the and you and you know the bonuses that we get from the factions and from units. Let's go ahead and do a fight. Now something I'm going to warn you about with brawl mode. Don't jump on YouTube and look up the best brawl mode teams. Okay? Just don't. Just jump in and try it. Because when you win your brawl mode fight, the next time you go in, the final battle is against the team that you used before. So if you go in with a monster killer team. You're going to have to fight that team later and be ready to beat your own team. And that's one of the tricky things about this is building a team is strong enough to win, but not so strong that it kicks your own ass later. Because you got to do a lot of brawl mode fights. You're going to constantly have to beat yourself. You're going to have to make sure that when you put your team together, you leave a back door, a synergy that can take out your team. So let's give it a shot. Yes, 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 yes. Tutorials, tutorials. That's great. Okay, continue. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so we're going to use Inos. We can always move her around, and we can always trash her and get a new unit. So let's see. We've got 50 coins. We can trash her and get a new unit, but let's just go ahead and take her. We'll put her here. And... We have 50 coins, so we can buy one other unit. So let's buy one other unit. It's a Azera Mage. Neither of these great synergy, right? There's no synergy, in fact, but it's our first fight. I'm going to put her up front with the Soul Weaver to keep her healthy. And let's try it. First fight's easy, right? Jenna's going to beat the crap out of this guy while Inos is doing her thing to help us along. Now, when we kill people, we got currency. We got 50 currency for winning that fight. So let's uh, let's pick somebody else. Yun Ryung. Okay, we got a knight, so we'll put her up front. Got 50 more. Let's pick another one. Second Yun Ryung, so we got an imprint. So she's just better at her job now. Um, you're a mage, and you've got range, so let's do this arrangement. 
You and Ryung tanks while everyone else kicks ass. Easy. Okay, we got 110 currency. You can, we can save up for something a little better, but let's go ahead and keep seeding the... Okay, we got an Inos imprint. It's kind of stinky. Hey, Lucy! Oh, hey, Nitor uh, Nitrosius. Thank you so much for the sub, buddy. I appreciate it, man. Thank you so much. Okay, we got a Rangar key. Remember, having Rangar on the field gives us more of this currency when we win fights. So we want to get as many keys as we can. So let's... Lucy is another healer. We don't have any space left. We've only got room for three people. And we can't add more slots yet. But uh, I think Lucy's a better healer than I know. So we'll swap her out. Move her here and her here. Maybe Lucy can go back a notch. Let's go kick some butt. Evil Jewel! Thank you for the prime, buddy. Look at Lucy keeping everybody healthy here. Nobody's... Well, they're losing health a little bit, but there's three on two. Can you blame them for losing some health? Thanks for the sub, Evil. They're getting a little hurt. Heal them up, Lucy. Okay, good job, good job. Okay. Okay, we got 130 world points. Part of that's this Rangar key giving us an additional 10 per hero. 10 per hero, so we get our normal 50 plus... The three. I think we need more space, though, so let's create a new spot. Now we can get Inos back on the team. We got the double Soul Weavers, so our, our recovery is going to go up with, uh, well, doesn't really help, right? Three Soul Weavers does nothing. One is enough. We need three Soul Weavers to get the extra bonus, so Inos, get out of here. Let's, uh, let's pick up another unit. A ra okay, Ian's a Ranger. We'll put him all the way in the back. He'll shoot things with arrows, right? Got our front line. It's weird that we're tanking with freaking Jenna, but we can't have all these people going into Yunryun. It's going pretty good, though, with Ian shooting things from a distance. Easy. Okay, 180. Let's get some more seats on the table. Five. Ooh, 150 to expand. Um... 50, we can bring one more. Oh, another Lucy. I keep getting dupes. Okay, well, we, we've at least got room for Inos now, so... More people on the floor. More people on the floor means more currency from the uh, uh, Rangar unit, giving us currency for every unit that survives. Remember, they have to survive. If they die, we don't get currency. Don't die! Don't die, Yunryun! God damn it! Okay, we aren't gonna get currency from her since she died. Freaking Yuna. You and your kiki rat. Okay, so we got four units worth of currency, so we got 190 that time. We can afford a silver unit. Or... I think we need to expand our slots, guys. I'm sorry. We gotta, we gotta get more room, one more unit. Freaking Jenna dupe. What is up with the dupes? Okay. It's the same format. Be aware that, like, every five floors, you run kind of into a boss. Yuna, Yuna was the boss of floor 5, so 5, 10, 15, those are the hard, hard floors. There are some other hard floors, but uh, those really stack up. Man, the, the healers are keeping on top of Yunryung. She almost died a couple of times there. Don't die, Jenna. Don't... Okay, good heal, Inos. Good heal. Want everybody to stay alive so I get all the Rangar currency. That should be a chunk of currency. Everybody lived. 150, nice. Hey just enough to fill that last spot with a silver tier unit. Ho oh, ho ho ho! It's another Rangar unit. Now we get, uh... Now we're going to get 20 currency per hero. So let's get you on the board. A couple of Rangers. Um, that'll help support these guys. Okay. They're my artillery. Good, good, good. Good, nobody died. Maximum currency. How much we get now with two Rangar? 190. Um, if I bring anybody else in, I've got to swap out. 
And I want to get more spots, so we're just going to take the same team in again. And then we can expand. Fighting a mage team. See all the mages? They got those barriers we were talking about. Just gives them extra rounds to survive while they're dropping bombs on us. Ooh, defense break. Okay, good, good. Healed that defense break away. Jenna, what are you doing? What are you doing, Jenna? Jenna could not handle that much booba from Cirilla. I need to move Jenna back. She is not frontlining well. Let's frontline with Ionos, put Jenna in the middle. Let's get expanded out to seven slots and pick up another unit. Hey, Exarian! Thank you for the thank you for the raid, buddy. Welcome, welcome, man. I hope you had a really good stream. We keep pulling dupes, and it's great. Okay, let's get somebody who's not a dupe. Oh, a knight. Perfect, perfect. Uh, let's put you in front. Let's see, we'll move Inos back. Hassel, we'll put Inos here. Mage can support... Where do I want the mage? Let's try something tricky. Let's, uh, let's do this. And see if I can sneak her around the corner. Make everybody a little bit less obvious. And you go up here and you go down here. And let's get you here. Let's see if I can sneak her around the back. I think it worked. It's just the rat and between Shuri and her, they'll murder this rat. Oh, she didn't go around back. I wanted to go around back and fight the mages. Oh, well, it still worked out. Everybody got killed giga fast. Do I like this? I love TFT for Epic 7, man. I play this when we're out of rewards. Okay, so... We can expand 8 next round, or we can pick up somebody new. We're 7 out of 7. I don't think we need anybody new. This is a hard floor. I can't remember what floor 10 was, but... Let's try a different strategy. Let, oh, shit. I didn't move everyone around. That's okay. This this envelopment's nice. I like this. Zahawk's gonna kill freaking... Don't kill... Oh, God. Don't kill it, Zahawk. No! She was a child, you monster. Easy. Oh, we murdered it. Let's pick up that eighth slot and a new unit, please. Camilla... We don't have any, uh, any of her faction, do we? I mean, we still put her in. Stick you down here, you up here. Knights. This, this, this. Weaver, Weaver, Knights, Knights. Can't decide, can't decide. I think supported by the Weaver, she might live. Concentrate fire down the middle. Let's give it a shot. Oh, Jenna did it, Jenna did it. She ran around the corner to get to the back 40, nice. See, this, this much bulk of people in the middle will make this back unit have no one to attack, so she'll run around it, and it's a nice way to send into the flanks. Oh, so many points. Everybody lived! Okay. 294. Okay, 8 is the maximum slots we have, so we can start beefing up. Um... Do we save for a 5-star? These are guaranteed to be... Oop, shit. Okay, well, I guess we're getting Shuri. Um, a Yunryung boost? Sure, another Yunryung. I oh, mean, our Yunryung's freaking B imprint. Um, you know what, girl? You freaking front and center tanking now. I like sending Jenna around the side. It's going to keep people from flanking our rangers. Look at Yunryung just taking it on the chin now that she's a B imprint. Wasn't bad. 
220 powder. Um, I really want a three star. Let's go one more, or five star. Let's go one more round. Oh shit, Yuna's back. Everybody's got target. Too many rangers, too many rangers. Oh my god, they're chewing us apart. The targets are so much damage. We lost so many units. We're going to get paid, but not a ton. Okay, show me someone amazing. Eh, not exactly what I wanted, but we'll make them work. Um, what bonus do we get from Zera 2? Increases attack and defense of bear and nearby allies. It's not that big of a deal. Um, I'm going to put you here, because if you can flank around getting to the back 40, you'll do a shit ton of damage, but he dies so easily. Do we have any other thieves? We don't have any other thieves, do we? What else can we get? Ooh, an Azera warrior. If we take out you and put in a Azera warrior... Nearby units, right? Vildred will probably go south, especially if I clutter the north. So he'll go south and stay near the Azera unit so that they will get the damage boost. Because remember, it's to nearby allies. If Vildred goes to the north, they'll be too far apart and the boost is wasted. How much boost do I get from three? I get nothing from three, so there's no reason to put Jenna in yet. Um, you know, Camilla, we're just going to sell Camilla for ten coins and get another one. Boost to Ionos, we take it. Okay. See, Vildra went right down beside Lorena, and now they're giving each other a, a boost because they're within one square of each other. As long as they stay near each other. You got Gala and 10 pulls? Grats, man, grats. Um, do we save or do we do a whole bunch of gold pull, a brown pulls and hopefully we get a five star out of them, right? I'm gonna spam. Bonus hostile, we take it. Uh, Cirilla is another key. We're pretty late in the fight, but uh, if we get up to four Rangars, we'll get a lot of, lot of points, but three doesn't do us any good. So we're gonna leave her sitting, a boost to our Glenn, Camilla, 38. You know, I don't see us using Jenna. Let's do another pull. Hey, another Ian. Okay, our archers are even stronger. Perfect. We need to get back to Pollard as fast. Not having a five star is hurting us here. Think MLK on buffs will do anything to the guy? I hope so. I'm skeptical, but I hope so. You are oh over. shit, here she comes. Oh, everybody's buff blocked. Freaking get them, guys. Did we lose Vildred? Where'd Vild Vildred in his glass freaking jaw? Okay. 400 points. Okay, guys, we're getting our five star. Somebody good. Ho, 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 ho. We got Gala. Okay. With City Lords on the team, who do we take out? Okay, Thief, that will let Vildred go stealth. So with two Thieves on the board, with two Thieves on the board, oh, it's just damage death. We need four Thieves for stealth. That's okay. Um, let's... Let's stick you... In place of place of who? Ionos, you're out of here. We're gonna do so much damage that we do not need a healer. Okay. Gala can attack over somebody with her dog, so she doesn't have to be right in front of them taking hits. She can hit from a space away. You got three Galas and one ten pull? Congrats on winning the game, buddy. Oh, our team's juice now, guys. 
I don't think we need another five star. Should we go for another five star? Or should we try to like pimp up what we already got? We're still 25 is the final floor. Let's get one more. Politis. What do we get from mages again? Boost to level. Suddenly I'm wish. Oh, and Cyril is still here. What if we go very mage heavy? Uh, let's see. How do we want to do this? Yoon's our best knight. Mages can stay in the back with rangers. Gala can attack over somebody. Vildred and Cyrilla can support with magic from distance. Ranger and ma mage bombardment. And I think Lucy's about all we got for healing and we'll keep her by the two most important units, Gala and Vildred. Up there, she'll do something stupid and run into the fight. Okay, let's try this. You notice this guy up here fighting for us? The sit having a city lord summoned a guy to fight for us. Fildred, what are you doing? You can't tank that many of them, even stealth. Never mind, Fildred, you're a Chad. Keep doing what you're doing. Okay. GG. Um, let's do it again. Nah, it's not terrible. You don't have to make sure your team sucks. You have to make sure that you have a way to beat your team. You don't need to sit here and re-roll for the perfect start and try to build, like, the unstoppable monstrosity. You just use a little bit of strategy and watch the way the enemy kills you. Like, this fight, we almost lost. Not almost. This fight, we lost. So you kind of want to screenshot this fight, right? It's layout and stuff and see how it killed you. And that's a good one to take in. Now... We can lose a few fights. We're still okay. Um, let's grab another five star. Mm, well, Destina is definitely going in place of Lucy. That's for sure. Do multiple weavers help us? No, not really. So we got Destina. Um, we're deep in enough that I don't really care about the keys anymore. We're not going to be stacking those. 45, Camilla get out. Let's look for an imprint. Hassle imprint's nice, but uh, 30, 40, 75, 85. It's not quite enough for uh, two extra pulls. I don't want to get rid of Lucy yet. Or Inos. Nah, this is fine. Let's try it. Okay, see how, see, how, see how they penetrated back and got at my rangers? That's what beat us. We lost our rangers too early. Freaking sure he's having a hell of a time with Lorena back there. Lorena got him. Luckily, Dustina's a stronger healer, but I think we're still losing. Oh my god, disaster. We've only got one heart left. If we lose again, it's over. Camilla again. Double Politus, we take it. More Shuri's, we take it. Okay. Five currency. Uh, 30 and 20. And we get Kikirat. We don't want a Kikirat. Oh, well. It is what it is. Okay, let's change this up a little bit. We want Yoon up top. And, uh, Destina, you can tank in the middle. Cirilla, you can reinforce up here so that guy doesn't kill Vildred. And let's move this artillery in a little bit. Okay, let's try this. There. Now, now, Camilla didn't get in the back and kill our artillery, so now we're, we've got a better setup. They friggin' murdered Destina, though. 
Estina didn't have the chops to tank that. I think we're good, though. Yeah, that was a better. As, lo as long as Shuri survived, we were in a decent space. Okay. More. Carrot. We don't need Carrot. And Jenna. Could get, we could get more mages. Five mages. After suffering the first attack, grants a barrier. For, it's a big barrier. Can we do five mages? We've got two, three, four. We can't do five mages. Um, we can do two more pulls. Better carrot. And a Lorena. Um, Cirilla out, carrot in. Destina. Destina back a little bit. That's not Destina. Destina back a little bit. Yunryun center line. You up here to back up Shuri. Go. Destina should keep him alive long enough to kill this orange guy. Nice. My city lord guy is doing his job. That worked out well. New hero player. Got Gala early. Should I try to push for the arty? I think you could skip the arty if you're new. I don't think the arty does much for you. It's a late game arty at best. Finally fought my way through Master's RT for the first time. Feel like I should keep playing till I hit Emp. At least there's half of the people I thought were Emp already. Go for it, man. As long as it's fun, just don't tilt with it, right? Um, do we do a 150 and a 50 or do 450s? What do you guys think? Is the RT good for BBK? If you're running an ER BBK, it's one of the better RTs. Um, We'll go for multi. Okay, great. More hassles. More Kiki Rats. More things I don't need. More Lucy's. We got rid of her. Another Kiki Rat. Okay. Ah. No. 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 We're crying out loud. 20, 30, 40, 85. Go. Son of a bitch with the Kika Rats. Oh man, there's an Angelica and a Stealth Vildred here and a Clarissa. We're going to get mugged. Oh shit, guys, we might have our first, uh, first like three loss L here. Wait, my Vildred's doing things. <laughs> get him, Vildred. Oh god, it's close. Shoot him, Shuri. Shoot him. Shoot him in the face. Ah, oh, I never doubted. I never doubted. Doubted a little. Okay. Something good. I got a PP. More Lorenas. More Inoses. Better Shuri. We take the better Shuri. Our Yunryung's improved. Um. 10, 20. 30, 45 is not enough to go up. Round 21. Carrot out, Kiki Rat in, Kiki Rat down here so Destina doesn't die so fast. You protect here. You go to here. You go to here. Hopefully we don't have flanked. Good. Good setup. Good setup. Good job, Shuri. You had me worried for a minute. Destina healed everybody up. Nice. Okay, show me something good. No more Jennas. I said no more Jennas. Kiki Rat's fine. Inos is fine. Carrot, whatever. Okay. Carrot, get the hell out. Jenna, get the hell out. 
Then it exits up there, top left. Something good. Okay, better kick your at. We take it. Go. Be careful going like a full tank down knight team, guys, because you only have 90 seconds to do the whole fight. So just going all knights and soul weavers can bite you in the butt. Uh, okay, we're just into the artillery. Just got to chew through this. Two left. One left. All right, we're almost there, guys. Another hassle, another PP, another hassle, another kick your at. Nice. Okay, hassle out the door. I know it's out the door. Somebody good. Camilla, frick. Okay. It helps when you start remembering the layout of the enemies, guys. Yes, this is literally Epic 7's version of TFT. Um, it seems to be working okay so far. The, the, these two seem to be seem to be frontlining nicely. not mess with success oh frick the dragon egg that's right this is the night team see how they all have reflect see how my vildred practically killed himself freaking wear off damn you wear off there okay it's starting to flash it's starting to go away okay reflect goes away you kind of want to do a slower staggered effect on this, right? So that they don't engage right away and you can kind of wait out the uh, reflect spell. But Vil Vildred just dies like a dog to that reflect spell. But but notice Vildred and Gala are both just gone from that. I'm, I'm left with just my tank and a weaver and my artillery. Okay, somebody good, no, somebody good, no, somebody good, PP, somebody good. Could I get somebody who's in, in the field and not on the right-hand side, please? Please and thank you. 20, 30, 49, 49, really, 49, 50. Oh, for crying out loud. 30, 40, 50, somebody good. Alexa. We haven't had an Alexa yet, have we? Four thieves, we've only got two. Okay. We're one round away from the finals. I'm, I do not have high confidence on this team yet, guys. This is not a great team. We're kind of clawing through by the skins of our teeth. We didn't do a, an early setup to make it good, but Sure they, I'm sure they can bring it home. I'm sure they can bring it home. We just have one more fight after this. All right. Somebody good. We take it. We take it. Freaking more Inos. We take it. Double S Kiki Rat, guys. Holy smokes. 39, 49. God, one away. One away. Okay. This positioning has done good by us so far. I am tempted to do this, but I'm just worried she's going to die in the front line a little too fast. Okay, let's go. Ooh, shit, that's a lot of people up front. A lot of stealth. You're making me get my hands dirty. Gal is hitting my knight. Is she going to kill my you knight? Don't one-shot me. Oh, damn, he's out there way, way, way Those ahead of my weaver. Dreams. Did she Usually just do it twice? Did end. she just do it twice to me? Come on, what the struggle. hell? Try your best. Though it won't make a difference. I I I Oh, she resets. Oh, that sucks. We didn't win, guys. Try to win next time. Man, this game is so toxic. To be fair, we didn't get anything crazy good at the start. So let's play one more, and let's play it a little bit more smart. So what you can do, guys, is you can just summon, and you're trying to get a Rangar unit, and as long as you get a Rangar unit, you're good to start. And if you don't get a Rangar unit, you can just yield and restart. But you want a Rangar unit, in a perfect way, you get two Rangar units. To start with, two Rangar units, and you get the big um, 
20 currency per fight, but double mage, double Rangar, that's a pretty solid start. Or double double mage, single Rangar, still a pretty solid start. Roll the sword, we'll roll it next. Now we're looking for another Rangar unit, so it's fish. Uh, create an extra space for him. Furious is a ranger, we'll stick him in the back. Notice how Furious ran up a little bit. His range is less good than the other one, so you want to start him a little bit so he doesn't waste time walking. So let's uh, let's let's move him up a notch for next time. And we're fishing for a little arena. Another key, another Rangar unit. Nothing. Thirty. Let's throw you out, and we'll throw you out, and give me a Rangar unit. Okay, Alexa's a thief. Fine, we'll just put you right here. Notice how Furious didn't have to move to start shooting people. Kiki Rat. Kiki Rat is a Rangar unit. He goes on the team and let's uh, let's add a sp Oh, we need a hundred to add a spot. That's fine. You can go in place of Alexa. Now we've got two Rangar units, so we're earning the double currency. And let's see. Go. Oh, Furious is a city lord, by the way, so we get an extra dude fighting for us. Nice, nice. Let's get an extra spot on the team. Let's fish, fish, fish. Um, none of these really interact with anything we currently have on the field. I guess of all of them, a knight would probably be best. Now we've got two knights, so we've got a little more defense. Remember, your goal is you don't want anybody to die because you want everybody to be alive so they count as currency for the Rangar keys. So we got 240 powder that time. Let's make a spot for somebody and um, let's see. Let's get a Soul Weaver on the field. Came pretty close to dying. Fish. Oh, a City Lord. Guys, we got two city lords. You saw that was a three-star summon, but we got a four-star. Just like when you do regular summons, there's a chance to crack to the higher levels. So let's see. We'll take you out and put you in. Now we've got two city lords, which means we'll have two soldiers on our side. I don't think you can really control where they spawn. I think they spawn like one hex off of the city lords. So one should spawn back here by Furious and one up here by Kawazu. Yeah, there's, there's, there's they are. It's good that you forgot your favorite comp to run because that means you aren't going to immediately go in with an overly strong comp. Nobody die. We want maximum currency. I, I don't think the spawned guys count. Verum, thank you for the sub, buddy. I appreciate it. Okay, we, can ex we can't. Can we expand? Okay, hang on. 220, um, 30, 40... 50. Unfortunately, we can expand but not add somebody. Let's just go one more fight. This is a solid team, especially with the two guys from the City Lord helping us out. Them both appearing down here is nice to bottle up our six. Usable? Usable? Link. Yeah! <laughs> Congrats, man! Freaking pen or quad rolled attack and then want. Yeah. Yeah, this is a very, very nice piece. Congratulations. Not the highest gear score, it wasn't the highest rolls, but anything hard focused into a single stat like that, massive. Okay, let's pick up a spot. Uh, I'd like to fish for Gala. If we can get Gala and get our third City Lord, holy smokes, a City Lord team would be amazing. Yeah, I'm going to hold off and try to fish for a 300. We're going to do one more fight. Mm. 
Mage team is really, really tanky because of the stupid barriers, but if you can chew through the barriers quickly, the mages don't have a lot of health beyond that. I don't think we lost a single unit, guys. I say that as Kawazu's about to take a dirt nap. No piece survived. Yeah, we lost somebody because we only got 210. Show me Gala. Show me Gala. Senya. Okay, you know what? We take her. We put her in and we get the we get the Dragon Knight bonus. Dragon Knight. So we're going to summon a Dragon Egg Core. And when we beat the Dragon Egg Core, it gives us a crit chance boost. Okay. Um, sure. Lucy. How adorable. Okay. Let's realize we're not running really with any Weavers except for Inos. And as weird as it sounds, I think Lucy is a stronger healer than Inos. Inos defense breaks, but Kawazu's come so close to death a few times. Let's get a healer back there beside him. Do you have any tips for a returning player, or should I start all over? Uh, how how far back were you, Captain Javier? I mean, if you're a returning player, man, just jump in and explore and have fun with the game. What is this, Smogate? This is Brawl Mode. It's a part of the Galilees event, and it is fun. This is one of my favorite side mini games. It doesn't cost stamina. Play it as much as you want. It's got great rewards. Even once the rewards are peated out, we still play it. I would love if they changed Guild Wars into something like this. Is Rod of Amaryllis worth maxing? No, but it is worth having. Just pulled a Soul Weaver Lucy. New character. Um, I didn't think you could pull Lu Oh, if you got Lucy in this, you mean? Sure, uh, you can pick her up in the side story. Furious gave everybody a crit chance buff. Huge for doing damage. You're not guaranteed to crit without it. Only bad for me is too, so long. Too many rounds. You know, just do like one a day and you'll get all the rewards. But if you enjoy it, you enjoy it. Have fun with it. Uh, 230. Um, let's get another spot on the field. That's... Insufficient powder? How much does it cost? Holy smokes. Okay. Okay, if once, we, once Furious shoots the egg. So I got Furious lined up with the egg. You want your Ranger lined up with the egg, so he takes the egg out first, and we get the crit chance bonus. Keek your rat, don't die. Don't you die. Keek your rat, you son of a... You failed me for the final time. We're replacing Keek. Oh, shoot. Is the Hawk's going to murder somebody? If he misses the crit, the Reflect could kill him, though. He missed the crit. Look how much damage it did to poor Zahak. Mm -hmm. His gold shield keeps him alive for one round, and now he's dead. 310 powder, bitchin'. Okay. We need a new spot, and... PP is a Dragon Knight, right? That gives us three, three Dragon Knights. If we can get Camilla, we have the entire Dragon Knight team. And then we can get the core that does crit chance and destruction. But until then, PP doesn't really do anything for us. So how about instead of PP, we put uh, maybe another Soul Weaver on the team that can defense break and chill out here beside Kiki Rat so he stays alive? You don't necessarily need to be right in front. Let's put you in the middle. Oh, shoot, I put him in the middle. She's going to attack the egg. Well, that's okay. The egg will drop fast this way with Furious and Senya on the egg. There we go. Crit chance boost. Extra damage. Is Gala even worth pulling? New player, yes. Just just get her. Don't look back. Don't forget, you can click 2x speed in the top corner. Oh, my God, we do this on 1x speed. Oh, my God. How did it take so long for you guys to point that out? Galilius. Oh, damn it, Zahak. You don't have synergy with anybody on my team. Fa. This is much better at 2x speed, right? <laughs> I need to move Senya. I don't like her in the middle. It's a waste of her talents. Fighting the egg. No one's dead yet. Oh, we're going to get so much from this, guys. Nobody died at all. How much? 240. Uh, let's see. 
Gala. Oh, City Lord team. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, who goes out? Um, oh, I, I, I like our, our, our triumvirate of knights here holding down the fort. I, damn it, Lucy. Okay. I like City Lord. City Lord will want Gala to be here somewhere. I don't want to get rid of our keys yet. We're still bringing in currency from having three Rangars. Oh, no, we only need two Rangars on the field. Three is useless. We can get what rid of a key bearer. Let me see. We get rid of Lucy or Carrot. Lucy or Carrot. I think we get rid of Carrot. Have the healer on board. We put Gala up here. Yeah, that way we get one guy north, one guy south. Knights up the front. You're healing the knights. Who did I get rid of to put Carrot in? Yeah, and, Car and Carrot, Carrot can drop bombardments from back here. Okay, let's try this. Carrot, where are you going? Okay, bad placement for Carrot. Must change. Carrot just got mugged. Holy crap. You're making me get my hands dirty. Blamo. You should feel honored. City Lord team too strong. Okay, I don't need any more five stars. I got Gala. She's the one that I wanted, so I'm going to lay off of the goals, and I'm just going to try to pick threes and fours and pump up the strength of what I got. It would be nice if I could pick up, pick up Camilla for another Dragon Knight. She's a three star, so let's chase that. Carrot, nice. Alexa, don't care. Alexa, don't care. Bonus to Furious, we take. Um, You can go out the door, 30... Oh, don't get rid of PP. She's a Dragon Knight. Jenna, 40. We'll keep Zahok just in case. Inos, out 50 and go. Ooh, a Ranger. Mm -mm. What do we get out of two Rangers? Increased speed for 50 seconds. I like the sound of that. We'll put you down here to shoot around the corner. And we got Senya down here. We need you up top where we're a little bit weaker. Good call. Remember to always have a ranger in line with the dragon's egg to kill it to get your crit chance bonus. Come on, struggle. Try your best. Though it won't make a difference. Is it worth bottling Gala's already? Absolutely not. It's barely worth, worth pulling her already. Hassle. Good, Kiki Rat, Inus. Ah. Out the door for 10 coins. Out the door for 10 coins. Give me Camilla. Ooh, we got our Dragon Knight team. Um, mm -mm -mm -mm. Sorry, Kiki Rat. Time to go. With the healer on you, you should be okay. Knights top bottom. Move you in the middle so you do a little more shooting. Okay, let's try this. That Politus worries me. We gotta get to that Politus fast. Those who chase pipe dreams. 605 bookmarks overall. 121 club, baby. Her artifact is good on MLK Ron for the effect res. Her artifact's really only good. Oh, I forgot Penelope. You're right. You're right. Oh, that was a screw up. We'll fix that next round. Um, I didn't sell PP, did I? I hope I didn't sell PP. Um, her artifact is best in slot for MLK Ron and is very usable on BBK if you're building an ER damage BBK. But that's really about it. So you got to decide if those two units are worth pulling that artifact because that's about the only uses. I guess there's a, a tertiary use you can use it on Elvira. Oh, good. PP's still in play. Um, okay, so now we've got a full Dragon Knight team and a full City Lord team. That's OP as fuck. Round 16. We should just be able to mow them over. Who are we going to get? More strength. More strength. More strength. None of these are helpful. 
None of these are helpful. None of these are doing anything for me at all. Spirit Lords are crazy good. But we don't have room for Spirit Lords just yet. My inventory's full, too full, so I gotta get rid of somebody. Hustle out the door. Uh, we're definitely not using Carrot anymore. Oh, guys. Oh, good, good. Guys, we've got two Spirit Lords. I mean, just check it, right? Spirit Lords, if you have two of them, you get four hits worth of skill null. I think we're just going to go back to, uh... I think we're just going to go back to enough Dragon Knights. Enough Dragon Knights to get the crit chance core, abandon the crit damage core. So let's get rid of... And let's get the Spirit Lords in. So you're a Ranger Spirit Lord, so we got lots of Rangers. You're a Knight. You are basically fodder. Oh, wait, no, 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 Senya. There we go. Knight, Knight. Big D damage dealer. Ooh, I like this. It's compact, but it should hit, it should go, it should shoot that core real quick and then blast through the middle. Okay, core's down, crit chance is up. Notice we got the, uh, you know, I shouldn't move her up to the front line. Even though she's a ranger, she's got four turns of skill and all. She's doing nothing sitting in the back. Though it won't make a difference. Brutal. We just savaged them. Okay, Silk, you uh, you go. You can go up here, and you can go down here. Because if they fight you, you've got your skill and all to protect you. Not you, Glenn. What are you doing down there? I said Silk. Glenn and Furious together, both hitting the core. Knights flanking, heavy DPS. I like it. More stuff. More stuff. Nope. 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 Something good. Ooh, boost to Quazu. It cracked up into a four star. I don't think there's any world where we're using Zahawk, guys. I know it feels weird, but I'm selling the five-star. Got another PP. Clarissa's really good, but she doesn't match the synergy of what we're building. Kiki Rat out. Lucy. She's our only Soul Weaver. Alexa out. Yunryung out. Summon. Another freaking hassle. Okay. My Queen Gala game. I love this game, man. What's Gala's best in slot artifact? Gala's best in slot artifact would be Wind Rider. If you don't have Wind Rider, Those then uh, uh, Prelude to a New Era, Portrait, um, what do they call it? Um, um, Symbol of Unity, just anything to boost her damage. Most people greater who are asking what her best artifact are aren't going to have portraits, aren't going to have preludes, so they're probably going to want to run um, you know, Exorcist Tonfa gives really good damage on her and doesn't stack a lot of HP. But uh, Wind Rider is arguably her best in slot. Anything that boosts her damage. Is ER damage Genua no longer meta? It's more niche. You can do some things with it, but there's so many things that soul burn to ignore ER or um, just plain have the effectiveness to chew through Genua that it's hard to get him with enough ER on him that matters. Oh, G Gala on RNL. You know what? That's actually viable. Another Camilla. Great. Another PP. Great. We're really boofed. Oh, yay. Spirit Lord. Ding or Dingo's better. 22. Let's see. Uh, let's Get rid of you, 32, 42, we really don't need you, 50s, 92, okay Lucy, you're out of here, 100, something good, another PP, and another Alexa. Man, our Dragon Knights would be stacked if we decide to go that route. 
Isn't Wind Rider stealth on kill? Why, yes. Yes, it is. And it makes the next attack you do insanely strong. So when she, she sicks the dogs on him with stealth, murders. Okay. Buff for Ian. Polidus is nice, but we're not going to use it. See that, you see that level 50 coin turn into a 5 star on me? Another Kiki you're at. I'm sorry, Paul. There's just no place for you in this game. Maybe next time. Alexa. Another Alexa. Get the hell out, Alexa. And a carrot. Okay. Onward and upward. How many Galilees as an artifact should I keep? I pitied her with five already along the way. Keep two. On, keep one at plus 15 and put all the rest in the other one. It's hard to think of a world where you would need more than two. You could possibly keep three if you want one for Elvira, one for BBK, and one for Twisted Idol on Kron. But it's unlikely you're running all three of those units at once on your on your team. And there's alternate artifacts for BBK and for uh, Elvira. Is Dark Blood Keeper good for Gala? That's uh, Genua's artifact, right? It's one of the only things I don't have in this game, so I really can't answer because I'm not sure what it does. No, 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 no. Come on. Keep your at. Sorry. There's the exit. Jenna out the door. Yun Ryung. Okay, round 20 is a tough fight. Let's do it. Pooth has Gala on that. Oh, does he? What's it do? Those who chase pipe dreams. What in the world is this? This meet a is Brawl end. Mode. Midnight Gala Lily's event, which I wish they would make permanent because it's fun. It's basically a uh, watered-down version justice. of TFT with Epic 7 units. <laughs> Ow, 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 ow. He hit everybody. Holy crap. Okay, we need, a, we need to send an assassin squad to take Vildur out before he does that shit to us again. Oh my god, we just lost. Our freaking dream team just lost. Okay. Um, let me see. Inos, Kikirat, Camilla. Oh, Angelica. We really should get Angelica on the team. We need a Weaver. Who can we ditch? Let's see. We've got... We, we need to keep our three city lords, right? That's a requirement. The dragon knights are nice, but we don't necessarily need them. Guess if anybody, Glenn, could go in favor of a healer. Though Glenn does give us that plus 10 extra speed. I kind of like that. Mm, 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 mm. Let's try this and see what happens. Angie, why are you frontlining? I thought you wanted to retire already. Come on, struggle. Try your best. Oh, that's Ian, not Glenn. Though it won't make a difference. I thought they were the same person. You're making me get my hands dirty. Old school Angie take you tanking. Feel honored. How do you play it? I'm trying to explain it as we go. You just try to think about placement, where they're going to move, who's going to synergize with who. Working a little bit of luck. Okay. You know what? There is a world where we get Destina. Right? We get Destina and we get five turns of skill and all, and she's just a better Angie. Do we do it? I think we do it. Destina! That is exactly not Destina. Get the hell out of here. Destina! You know what? We will take a Gala upgrade. Holy smokes. That makes you giga strong. Okay. Let's go. Okay. This time Angie went to the middle. And that's kind of where I wanted her. Healing the knights. Come on. Struggle. Try your best. Within the game, you do the uh, you do the um, Galilius Midnight Brawl event. Read it, good story. Dreams. Once you get to the point where you can't do it anymore, back out to the main Usually menu and you'll see Brawl Mode in the corner. End. Oh, that murdered! That murdered! Okay, boom, Camilla. Oh, none of these are really helping. Right. Let's see. 
carrot out the door, two more, Camilla. That's really a double S Camilla. You know what? We're going to try it. And we'll pull you down to tank a little bit better, and we'll put you over here for damage, because I'd be a freaking double S. How can we not have her on the team? She's still enough to give us the, uh, the, the Dragon Knight bonus. What's the Warrior bonus? Just damage. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Okay. She still, she still ran into the thick of it. Look at her go. Look at the damage she's doing. Holy crap. Blam! Didn't stand a chance. Is Banquet better than Shepherds on BBK? Shepherds gives her evasion. Banquet gives her effect resistance. If you're building an ER BBK, Banquet. If you're building just a, a, a counter degen BBK, then Shepherds. As far as damage goes, I'm not sure. I'd have to look at the damage calculator to see which is better. Is Gala's artifact worth summoning? I don't think it's necessary. I think it's skippable. Its uses are kind of niche. With the exception of ML Charon, everyone else has alternative artifacts they can use. Oh, Ian. Is that enough to get Ian back in play? I don't think it is. I don't think I'm ready to take anybody out. I'm kind of liking our dream team here. They got an egg too. That reflect damage is going to hurt when we have crit Come like on, this. Struggle. Try your best. You've not seen Brawl Mode, Wolf? It's freaking awesome, man. I love this shit. Uh, it's a looking hairy. Freaking the double S Camilla pulled through though. Look at her go. Nice. 200 victory points. We need to clear some room. PP out the door. Hassle out the door. Destina. Freaking Zahak. Zahak, get the hell off my screen. Carrot, you can go. Rose, you can go. Jenna, you can go. Destina. The Hawk really wants to be a part of this team, guys. So there's no gear involved. That's right. But there are factions and there's synergy. And you can click the notes on the side to see what things do when you get more of them together. And you can also get a view of who's actually carrying their weight. Senya is kicking ass on this, right? Usually me Senya and Galia, but, but I mean, look, Kawazu and, and, and Angie are just kind of stinking up the joint. So it kind of give you an idea of who you should replace, too. And you can look at the synergies, right? You you do some summons, you, you pick up some units. Dude, we just got triple S Camilla. And you can look over here and be like, if I pick up one, two more Soul Weavers, I'll heal more. If I can pick up one more Spirit Lord, I'll get five rounds of skill and all instead of four. So it can give you an idea of what you uh, could fish for. But this is the final fight, and since this is the final fight, everyone else goes. We're going to do one last Hail Mary summon. Okay, we can't do a three, a five star, so we're just going to hope for an upgrade. Alexa, that's kind of sad. But hey, we got ten coins, right? So th there's at least that. So it gives coins back. Carrot. For crying out loud, Camilla loves me today. Another carrot. Okay. 20. It's not enough. Okay. Well, this is it, guys. This is what we got. I remember Gala's in the back. We need to get to her and get to her fast. So I'm going to put a concentrated burst of units right here. And then I'm going to try to sneak. I'm going to put these up here, right? Let's let's wait. Let's draw everything to the north. Let's draw it all to the north. And then try to sneak Camilla around to the south. What do you think? Will it work? Let's 
Spirit Lord. Let's try it. Oh no, they were too heavily they were too heavily packed in here. Come on, struggle. Try your best. We need to get in the back. We need to get to we need, we need to get to his gala fast. Those who chase pipe dreams usually meet a bitter end. Okay. You're making his me gal is hitting our furious. You should feel honored. Get on the gala. Okay, we're on his gala. We're on his gala. His gala's down. Gala's down. I think we got it, guys. I think we got it. Nice. Not the cleanest victory, but any win you can walk away from is a win. Now you see, because we won the Brawl Mode, we have become the champions of Brawl Mode. My team has become the champion team. That means next time when I fight and beat the 25th floor, I will have the option of challenging my champion team, and I've got to come up with a team that can beat this team. The AI is going to take over my team, and i got to fight my own team. So you want to be careful about putting together a team that is super giga strong or you're not going to be able to win against your own team. Yeah, do you like it? And if you come up with a super strong team that beats that team, now your super strong team becomes the champion team. And when you get there again with your next super strong team, you got to beat your super, super strong team with your super duper strong team. And then you, so a lot of it is not just building a stronger team every single time. A lot of it is coming up with ways to beat it. That was a... City Lord and Spirit Lord team. So I got to look at the things that Spirit Lords do and the things that City Lords do and come up with teams that can defeat it. Now City Lords spam a lot of these soldiers. So you can run Dragon... Oh, not Dragon Knights. Where is it? Um, you can run... You can run a six knight team and grant reflect and those little soldiers the city lords take will die like that. So city lords, or sorry, so just regular knights plus, uh, I don't know, maybe, uh, maybe mages that give barriers after they're attacked first. So your knights are reflecting damage while your mages are frontlining and taking almost no damage at all because of the big barriers and reflect is doing the damage for them for the first 20 seconds. Now you chew through that. So you can kind of come up with plans and then the next time you're like, well, how am I going to beat that? So the next time you think, well, I got to deal with reflect and, and barriers. So instead, you put a whole bunch of frontline knights that occupy everybody and just can take the hit, and you back them up with some healers, and you have some rangers dropping in long bomb damage from the back, so that by the time their barriers and uh, reflex wear off, you're able to nuke them with rangers. Well, then how are you going to beat your rangers? Well, maybe you come up with thieves. Thieves can go into stealth, and you can position thieves to slide around the corner. So it's really cool the way this is that... There's no one team that beats everything. You can always find a way to game the system and figure out how to beat what you just created. But be very careful about creating something that is incredibly difficult to beat. But if that happens to you, I'm going to be doing this the entire time. And we'll pull you into a Discord room, we'll bring you up on stream, and we'll walk you through how to beat the problem you've created, and we will make sure we have never failed yet. We've never failed to get somebody out of a tangle. Sometimes I have to tap in some TFT masters and bring them in with me, but we will make sure you do not paint yourself into a corner. So make sure you, uh, you jump in the Discord, you follow the stream, and uh, you DM me when you need help. We'll figure it out. But this... I hope you guys enjoy this as much as I do. This 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 is uh it's something you can do. It costs no stamina. Even once you've gotten all the rewards, it's just a side thing that you can do to have fun with the uh with the game that doesn't cost stamina. It's got great rewards to it and it's challenging, it's clever, and it's not like anything else in Epic 7. So I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. But let's roll this sword. Okay. We going straight to max, guys. 
Is Gala Lilius worth getting? She's probably more worth getting than any RGB unit in the game. That is a banner, limited banner unit. Yes. Yes, a thousand times yes. If you don't have Gala Lilius in your life, is it really worth living? I mean, it probably is. But it would be so much better with Gala Lilius. So yeah, pick her up. Pick her this up. This makes us appreciate Tess G's ability to create a problem and a solution to that problem. <laughs> Come on, give me something good. Go! Ah! Oh, that was really focused, guys. That was really, really focused. Whoa. Whoa! Six, 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 seven, eight. What a badass a weapon. Holy crap. I can change this attack to crit chance and make this like the ultimate bruiser weapon. Uh, but not a lot of not a lot of HP bruisers want speed though, so I might just leave it the way it is. But god, that crit damage. Oh, that's sexy, guys. That is sexy. Maybe I even just change the speed to crit chance and throw it on uh throw it on Robbie. Maybe I just leave it the F alone and use it. I'm happy with this piece. I hope your guys rolls really well too. This will definitely find a home. All right, guys, this was a lot of fun, and we will do a lot more of this tomorrow, but it's past midnight, and I got to get some shut-eye so that we can uh, get up early in the morning and do some more TFT as well as all of the other daily stuff we got to do. If you have any questions, hit me up on Discord. Thanks, to everybody, for being here for this late-night stream. Good luck on your pulls. I, I hope when you go to Gala and, and you click the button and you do a 10-pull, she pops out just like this. God, it would have been great, though, right? It would have been really great. Oh, well. Do this, but with Gala. All right, everybody. On, you have a great rest of your evening. And yes, for anybody that asked before, one more time for the people in the back, Gala Lilius is one of the best PvP and PvE units. She is somebody you want on your account, whether you're brand spanking new or a seasoned veteran. You will, you will find uses for her all throughout the game. She can one-shot Banshee. She's great on Water Expedition. You can use her to full auto Nightmare Raid Jewel Leave. When Advent comes out, she is always a figurehead for it. She's a tank buster for, um, for Guild Wars. She can be a tank buster as long as there's no Ilanov involved. She's a tank buster for Arena. She is a staple unit in RTA. And uh, you build her how you want to build her. Mine is somewhat of a monster, but uh, I think with how strong she is, it just shows how important I feel this unit is that I've invested this much in her. So, yes.